I was very inspired by the interview I saw on the big orange couch uh, that was given by Dennis Crowley, the co-founder and developer of Foursquare, um, one of the leading location-based social networking apps. However, that one is probably the most popular one out there, but I would like to share with you some other apps that are very similar and very worthwhile. The first app we're going to look at is Gowalla. Like Foursquare, you check in at your locations um, and you can update your statuses and all that and check out the spots around you. What sets Goala apart from Foursquare, I think, are the trips because, you know, you can do various pub crawls or, you know, like the Freedom Trail in Boston. There are plenty of, you know, fun activities to do that take you to multiple locations and build up your passport where you can collect stamps and pins from the places you go and also, you know, based on the item based on the places you go, you can find items that people leave behind or earn points that give you rewards in the various locations you visit. See, for instance, I'm carrying these items and when I leave them, people can retrieve them and they can be exchanged for real life rewards. What's more, in the spots you're at, if you don't see where you actually are, or if you want to create a new location, that is completely possible. A similar app um, is RallyUp, but what sets it apart is the fact that it's completely based on privacy as its slogan is real friends. You know, it's you determine exactly who sees what you do and, um, you know, who, who has access to the to the places you're visiting. A really cool feature is that the alerts allow you to send messages and um, keep basically a whole dialogue going with the friends that you're connecting with. Um, and so it's kind of like a free way to text the people that you're on Rally Up with. And again, you, know, you can share photos and statuses from your location. Um, and a really cool thing is also you can say, you know, if you're on the way somewhere, um, or, you know, see a map. You can see other locations in the vicinity. This also works overseas, which is cool. So you can, you can, and, and it's totally based on an overhead map. Um, so you can, you know, see in, in real time what the location looks like. And if you want, you can share public comments on locations that everyone can see so that when you're going to a new place, you know, you can see what other people have said regardless of whether or not they're your friends. Um, but you can also choose to, you know, to make your actions private within, you know, certain friend circles. Finally, I'm going to show you Whirl, which has also actually been quite popular, but I think it is a really cool app as well. So the fun thing about this is you earn points wherever you go. Um, and, you know, you can get badges kind of like Foursquare, but also it's based a lot on recommendations as well. So, um, you know, for each recommendation you make that people take, you gain points and you go to different levels or you can become a founder if you create a new place. Um, and it, again, shows you nearby places. Um, and the societies you've become a member of simply by where you visit or where you have been, um, where you want to go, or, you know, where you have um, liked your recommendation of. So even if you're not currently at a location, you can still, you know, get points for going to, for ha having been to a place. For instance, you know, I have been to Panera and I have tried the smoothies. So since I've done it, and I recommend this recommendation, we both get points. So, and also, you know, you can recommend things, and if people take your recommendations, it boosts your status and gives you rewards. And, um, you know, you can become members of certain societies and see the activities that they suggest. And um, it's, it's a very interactive and fun way um, to not even just stay connected with your friends, but, you know, get out there in society and see what other people uh, recommend and say about things. Um, and also, 
it's nice because you can combine forces with friends and you can um, also choose, you know, specific groups of friends to share certain activities with, so much like Rally Up, um, although not as extensive, but there are, there are some very nice features. So now that you know what, what's out there, it's up to you and your friends to decide which app best suits your social networking needs. May the power of location-based services be with you. Check out iPhoneApplicationList.com for other apps, reviews, and all the hottest updates.